Hi everyone. So uh, welcome to my new video. So my name is Prashant and uh, in today's video what I am going to show you is like how we can clone a single branch into our local machine. So what I am going to do is like I have got uh, this Azure DevOps and I have got a uh, git repo over here ASP.NET Core with Angular. So I have got a simple project over here which I have got. So right now what I am going to do is like I am going to create a new branch. Let's say I am uh, taking out a new branch which is something like features uh, identity. Right, so this branch is going to contain the development work of identity. So we have got this features identity branch. So let's quickly create it. So we can see that we have got this identity branch, user authentication branch within this features folder. We have got this dev branch and we have got a master branch. So let's say suppose that I want to do the development on the identity branch itself and I don't uh, need to or like I don't want to clone any dev or master or user authenticating authentication branch in my repository. So for doing that what we can do is like let me quickly go to the explorer. So what I will do is I will go to my computer. So within this PC, I'm going to use my C drive for uh, cloning this repository. So I've already got git bash installed. So let me quickly open git bash, right? So over here, what I will do is like, I will copy the URL of the repository. So this is the URL. So I'm copying this URL and I can provide git clone the URL which I had copied. After that I can say I want to get the branch which is like features slash identity right. So I am trying to get the identity branch. After that I will use the single single uh, branch option over here. So once I have selected this single branch, what I can do is like I can provide the name of a folder for where I want to like install or like copy the branches. So let me uh, say this is a identity folder. Right. So let me quickly uh, clone this. So as you can see that it has quickly cloned my identity uh, branch. So if I go within my C drive, if I try to search for identity, I can see that I have got this identity branch with me. So once it is with me, what I will show you is like, I will quickly navigate to that identity folder, right? So this is the folder where I had this details. So if you see over here, it's showing that uh, its current branch or like the pointer is within features identity. So if I use the command get branch hyphen A, so you can see that it's uh, currently pointing to this features identity branch and it has uh, got a remote tracking branch of remote origin feature identity. So this is a simple way like how you can clone a single repository without worrying about the other branches in the repository. So hope so that you like this video. Please let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. Thanks for watching this video.